Not feeling well? Need to see a doctor now? St. Luke's video visits 24-7. Download the St. Luke's mobile app from the App Store or Google Play Store. He was special. Uh, I told him on a number of different occasions that uh, I was glad that our life paths crossed because as I was a better person as a result of it. Uh, he was he was like uh, he was like a son. Uh, I used to say quite frequently that uh, he's the kind of guy that you hope that your daughter brings home and introduces you, introduces you to. Uh, he was he was a fantastic athlete. He was a great football player, but he was even a better person, and that says all you need to know about Brett Snyder. Tremendous role model. Uh, you know, I our, our got to give a lot of credit to our parents um, for instilling a lot of values, core values, morals into us. But, you know, um, he took care of me quite a bit because I was a little bit on the wandering side of the path and uh, he was more of the straight and narrow. So he had to straighten me out more than once. Um, and, uh, you know, now I live my life to try to live up to those expectations that he's he's taken from, you know, our parents. But um, what a fighter, you know, fought, fought to the very last second, la last breath. He was a leader. Uh, football at Northwestern changed in 1995, and his that the team that he led uh, was responsible for that, and he led by example. He wasn't a... He wasn't uh, a rah-rah type of guy, although he would he would express himself. But uh, he was he was more about um, you know, working hard, doing the right thing. Just the ultimate human being, you know. When you look up somebody that that always just does the right thing, um, helps the next guy, is so selfless that he's going to um, you know, forego his own happiness for somebody else. He's a servant of people, a servant of bigger ideas, a servant to uh, other things. He's just selfless and, um, you know, a, a fighter and a warrior.